Hi, okay, so you might be watching this video immediately after another video in which I look exactly the same because I am doing an unboxing binge because it was my birthday, which is only somewhat related in the fact that my sister got me the Allure subscription box and that just arrived and I received the Notoriously Morbid subscription box, which I will link my video up there because uh, that one's gonna come first. So we are going to unbox the Allure subscription box because you know, I always want to do unboxings because I love watching unboxings. I love unboxing stuff. And then the mail arrives and I get really comfortable on the couch and super excited and I don't do it. So we're going to do it together just really quickly. I'm in a rush, clearly. So, oh, look, it's so pretty. By the way, Lex, I'm going to make you watch this. So thank you so much. I really appreciate this. What a fun present. I love it because it's like months and months of presents all in one continuous thing, whatever. Anyways, this is what it looks like. It feels quite legit, like very nice and solid. Uh, it reminds me of when I used to get birch box and I used to reuse the boxes always. So super cute. Ooh. Let's see what's in here. Oh, it smells good. It must be something minty in here. I love mint. I love mint so much. Okay. Best of beauty. Oh, I saw people doing this. NARS Velvet Matte Lip Pencil. I'm so excited. I just got the Dance Fever color of that pencil in another subscription box, and I'm kind of hooked on it. Ciate London Dewy Stick Luminous Hiding Balm and Gleam. I don't know about that stuff. Like, I got one in uh, my sister's previous birthday present to me, a uh, highlighting balm, and it just seemed like I was rubbing Vaseline on my face, so I don't know. Shampoo and conditioner, always good. La Roche Posay, oh, I'm so psyched. It's a colloidal oatmeal skin protectant. I have sensitive skin, very dry skin. I've been wanting to try La Roche Posay for ages, so yes. A cure brightening facial scrub, meh. If it's not made for dry, sensitive skin, then I will be giving that to my coworker, Taylor. You got some stuff coming your way. And then a bunch of other stuff about how to use things or whatever. Okay, let's open it. Ooh. Oh, what's this? But wait, there's more. Welcome to the Low Beauty Box. As a member, you also get sneak, uh, you get free sneak peeks, tutorials, and discounts, and blah, blah, blah. I'm probably just gonna open the presents and enjoy. All right, cool. Uh, oh, ooh, Victor and Wolf, right? Victor, Victor and Wolf flower bomb, but this doesn't feel like the perfume. What is this? Oh snap, it's like a legit mini perfume. I thought it was gonna be a little dropper, which is the only way I've ever gotten this before. This might be perfect for our upcoming trip to Seattle. Let's have a whiff. I feel like I've thought this was too floral for me. We'll see what Patrick thinks. <sighs> a little floral. I'm a little more musky beachy. All right, what else? The dewy stick, okay. Let's see what this looks like. Let's just see. Uh, Ciate London. I do love Ciate. They're glitter luminous lip things where you press, glitter flip, jeez. Those things are pretty great. Yeah. This looks just like the other thing. And I think, I think this is for teenagers. I'm not sure. I have a mirror. I've been wearing this makeup all day. Let's just. Yeah, it looks like I put Vaseline on my face. I would rather moisturize and have actual moisture than rub Vaseline on areas to look like I highlighted. I mean, it's got a little shine to it, which is cool, but I'd rather have a moisturized dew than fake it with a Vaseline stick. Let's look in the monitor. Ooh, I mean, it looks kind of cool, but I don't know. I'll give it a shot. I'll give it a shot. The packaging is kind of cute. It's kind of cute, right? Yeah. All right. Um, the NARS lip pencil. I'm super excited about this. I think they're like 22 bucks and I started researching dupes for these, uh, which I discovered the Sonia G. Sonia Kashuk? No, Sonia G. I'll link it down below, whatever the dupe is for this, but it's like a Sonia matte lip pencil and um, you can get it on Amazon for like a quarter of the price. So pretty good, pretty good color. I'm just, I'm trying it on. Why not? I had a clearer gloss on underneath, so this is more glossy than I like it. Like, I love the fact that these are matte. They stay really well and they feel really good. It's a good color. Yeah, it's it's good, I like it. I've been enjoying nude lips lately, which is not me normally. 
I think it's because I'm going crazy with the eye makeup. But this is Dolce Vita um, for my skin tone, which is like an NC15. This is like a little more of a, a plump brick red, a little more noticeable, and Dawn's Fever is just like the perfect mauve nude um, cool tone. I know I'm warm tone. I don't know why I like cool tones much, but it looks really good. But I like this, I'm gonna stick with it. All right, the Acure Brightening Facial Scrub. Sea Kelp French Green Clay. Whenever it says clay, I stay away because I have dry skin. So I'm pretty sure this will be going to Taylor. Shell Powder, Kaolin. Yeah, I'm just not even, like I can feel my skin cracking just talking about it. La Roche Posay. I'm wearing some perfume from the subscription box I had before. And it's kind of growing on me. It's marshmallow and dragon fruit, orange something, I don't know. So this is a teensy tiny little La Roche Posay thingy, um, but I'm gonna try this on tonight because I can always use more moisture and this is obviously an occlusive, um, which I've been interested in adding more occlusive into my skincare because I use a bunch of hydration with uh, and humectants, hyaluronic acids, nail mucin, stuff like that. So I need more occlusive to seal that moisture in as dry as I am. Yay. And then we have the uh, Color Protectant Shampoo and Conditioner, Nature Lab Tokyo. It sounds almost familiar. Water, alcohol. Really? In the conditioner? Why? Ceteral alcohol. Is that like normal alcohol? I know some alcohol can be humectant, but anyways, blah, 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 glucose. So, all right. And then a bunch of oils. I'll give it a shot. Yeah, why not? Flawless Frizz Fighting Primer. <laughs> okay, <laughs> well, I'll see. We'll see how that works with this crazy hair. Yeah. Anyways, that was super fun. Thanks so much, Lex, for the present. I, I, I'm i gonna make you watch this because then it's like you're unboxing the present with me. Um, I know you get it too, the lore box. So I'd love to hear what you like the most and I'm coming to see you soon. So if there was something that you love like this, dewy stick thingy and you want it, just let me know and I'll bring it with. Um, also, if you know how to use that, uh, maybe I'm missing the thing. I, I don't know. Anyways, thanks so much for the present. Thanks so much for hanging out and watching and um, stick around for Halloween, which is like next week, crazy. Well, okay, the start of Halloween madness because I got things cooked up and I'm gonna be posting three days a week. Monday, Wednesday, Friday, 8 a.m. every time. It's gonna be fun. Okay, anyways, thanks.